hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video how is everybody today's good friday um i'm recording on my phone because i've left the camera at home <laughs> i know uh but today me and my sister are visiting my uncle um so my sister and the boys were on their way they were they're not that far behind me i've just pulled up and i thought i would start the vlog um i don't know whether this is going to be a daily vlog or a weekend vlog um I'm not sure. I know I said in the last video that it was going to be like a weekend vlog, but I don't know how much I'm going to get filmed. So we'll see. I'm I'm not 100% sure. We'll see where, where we have to go. And I feel like I've been windswept. I've had the window open. Um, so anyway, I'm going to see where Casey is. Um, we've got each other on our like find friend things. Um, so I'm going to see where she is. And um, I don't know what door number my uncle lives at because he's moved. <laughs> um, he's moved to the flat directly downstairs, but I don't know what number that is. Um, so hopefully Casey does. Uh, so I'm going to find out where she is because um, I need the loo too. <laughs> too much information, but um, yeah. Right, let's let's get inside. So we've just had some lunch. It was really nice. I had a uh, southern fried pasta thing. I did look at the sins. It was nine sins. So um, well within. And I haven't had anything today. So that's all good. Mike is here on, um, on his iPad. And then Ollie's here on his iPad. Casey and my uncle are over here. We've just had lunch. Uh, this is his new flat. It looks exactly the same as the other one. Um, it is literally identical um it's just got new carpet and the kitchen like the sides are a bit different and and over here he's got like a fridge freezer where downstairs he had a low um fridge so um but yeah and over this way he's got a door out into the garden which is really nice so in the summer it'll be able or the spring when it's nice and warm it'll be able to have the uh, the door open and there's a chair out there he can go and sit outside and whatnot so um yeah, but... Mikey, you want to say hello? He can't hear me, he's got his headphones on. <laughs> and Ollie's enjoying his roll. Mm. Wave. So, yeah, we're just going to enjoy this afternoon. Well, hello, it is now Sunday night. Um, you would have seen a couple of clips um, and I think I would, I, I'm gonna insert a couple of photos as well. So I'm just gonna explain what's happened over this weekend. Um, on Friday, we went to see my uncle and that was fine. It was really nice. It was nice to see him. Uh, the boys loved it. And it's funny because Mikey is not really an affectionate per person or child. Um, and with my Uncle David, his Uncle David, he always gives him hugs and, like, very affectionate. Um, not kisses or anything, but, like, always goes up and hugs him and then just randomly, while we're there, go, we'll go up and hug him. Um, which is just, just melts my heart. It's so cute. Um, Ollie... Well, he does as well, like, when we get there, we'll give him a hug, and when we leave, he'll give him a hug and stuff. Uh, but that's not unusual for Ollie, but for Mikey, it's quite unusual. Um, he does it with people that he sees a lot, obviously. He does it with me, does it with Ian, uh, my mum and dad, and stuff like that. But, obviously, we don't see David that often. Um, but, yeah, it's just so nice. It's really lovely. Um, so, once... Um, once we had, I'd seen David, um, Ian was at the garage, he was doing something to his car, that's right, so in the morning I went and helped Ian put his car on some ramps and that because he needed to get underneath it, um, and then I went to see my uncle and then I had to pick Ian up from the garage because his car was in pieces. <laughs> he then realised that um, his radiator had a, had cracks in it, 
so that is why he was leaking uh, coolant and stuff so he knows a few people that break golfs and um, like scrapyard type people and stuff so um, he contacted one of his friends and he's like yeah yeah we've got one um, and Ian was like, I know it's bank holiday weekend, when, when will you be there? And he was like, oh, I'm, I'm here tomorrow until 2 o'clock. So on Saturday we went and got weighed, um, we went to the CAF and then uh, we went and picked up this radiator. In the meantime, we got stuck in the most horrendous traffic ever. So getting there was fine, uh, but trying to get back was an absolute nightmare. Um, so it was a 35 minute journey and it took us nearly 2 hours and 20 minutes to get back for Ian to realise it was the wrong radiator. Um, so he rang his friend back and said, it's a different one, it's wrong. Um, and his friend was like, oh I have got, because he thought that all Mark IV Golf's radiators were the same, whether it was diesel, petrol, whatever. Um, but apparently there's one type of car that's different and that's my type of car so I've got a diesel um, and I've got a certain engine a, a certain diesel engine um, but anyway so his mate was like um, and this was at dead on two o'clock I think and he was only supposed to be there till two and his mate was like well can you come back now? I'll wait for you. It's fine. So he did, and he did wait for us, and it took us about 35 minutes to get there. Um, but we went, like, back sh back roads and country lanes and all this, that, and the other, um, which which was fine. And then what we did was we was going to South End on Saturday night anyway uh, with um, our niece, Jodie, Vin and the baby and Ian's sister was coming with her other half and Charlotte um, so we was like well we're already halfway there I think it was uh, by the time we left there it was about uh, three o'clock by the time Ian was chatting and stuff and they were packing up ready to leave getting ready to leave and whatever um, so it was about three o'clock and Ian said, should we just go to South End now? Because there's no point trying to get back through all that traffic that we sat in to then have to go back. So that's what we did. We went to Leon C to Two Tree Island. And um, Ian got some seafood. I really wasn't feeling it. I, I just didn't want any seafood. Um, I think I've got a picture of Ian holding some cockles. <laughs> um, I got some crab sticks, well, seafood sticks. Um... I just had a couple of them. I just, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it. Um, and we went to Two Tree Island, um, which is right next to Leon Sea. Um, and we sat there for a few hours. It was really, really nice. Um, I curbed a wheel. I know. Um, oh, I'm so, I am so angry with myself. Because Ian said, you won't get in there unless you go straight head on it. So the car park like it's a big massive car park but there's like an a fenced off bit with like gaps in the fence um and i needed to go left and ian said you're better off going in that car park and then straight across and i was like no 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 i can do it i curbed a wheel and chipped the powder coat so i'm very annoyed with myself for that um and so we didn't get home till late and was he in at work last night i can't remember <laughs> i'm so tired <laughs> um so it is currently quarter to 12 um and i've just dropped ian off at the yard but let's go back to yesterday um so Today, we was back at the garage, um, not realising that the clocks had changed as well. So we got up an hour after we should have really got up. Because um, we wanted to get there early, or Ian wanted to get there early to get some bits and pieces done. Um, so we've been there. I did some knitting, so there's a little bit of me showing my knitting. Um, I've nearly finished a sock. 
um, is not there, but I think I'm sitting on it now. I am. Um, I've nearly finished a sock. I'll show you that in a in a second. Um, so today's plan was to fit the radiator, um, fit whatever else Ian needed to fit, and then get the water back into the car. We did all that. We started putting the water in at the top and it started coming out at the bottom. <laughs> so the water pump that Ian put in was leaking and it was leaking all over the floor. Lucky enough, Ian's got one of the oil pans and that is what he emptied the water into because it's quite new uh, liquid, like, coolant. It's quite new coolant. Um, so there was no need to replace it with new. Uh, so he just made sure that the tub was as clean as he could get it um, and then just emptied all the water into that and then we was filtering it from that into a bottle then into the car. Anyway, so we managed to get that big pan back under um, and I think it caught most of it but a lot was over the floor. Um, so... That was that. Then Ian realised that he needed to take the water pump back out. He needed to seal it um, with some sealant stuff. He does, doesn't... You don't need to do that, but obviously it was leaking, so he was like, I'll put some sealant around it. Um, and that, yeah. So, we've been at the garage all day. Uh, got home, had some dinner, and then we've just been sat here watching um, Kin. Uh, it's an a program that's filmed in Ireland. Um, it's really, really good. Uh, it's just K-I-N, Kin. Um, it is really, really good. Uh, so we're watching that. And then he was like, oh, I need to get ready for work. So, yeah, we're back at the garage tomorrow to try, sorry, I've got to say it in my teeth, um, to try and get Ian's car fixed. Well, it's not broken. It's not broken. There's just a little leak. Um, and then get all the other bits on that he needs to get on and then hopefully tomorrow um, he can drive it back home. So, oh what a palaver it's been. An absolute palaver and it's like, it feels like it's consumed the whole weekend. <laughs> um, but never mind. Um, none of the shops or anything were, were, were open today anyway. Um, so... We did, we did get takeaway in the end because we was just like, what do we do? Nothing's open. Didn't, didn't pre-plan or anything. Um, so we got a uh, Turkish pizza. It was really nice. So like Majun, it's like on a um, wrap, and they put a mince meat mixture thing on um, with loads of salad. It was really, it was really nice. We had that. Um, but yeah, I just, I feel absolutely drained. Really, really tired. Um, I was sat here earlier on and I was like, I could just go to sleep. And I said, I need my afternoon nap. Um, and even at the garage I said that, I need my afternoon nap. Um, but, yeah, so this weekend, it's, been, it's not been very Easter-y. Um, so I do apologise about that. But this is my life. <laughs> this is just the way things go. Um, it's very different to some people and... Not everything is about what's going on everywhere else, if that makes sense. Um, I did eat the rest of my Easter egg last night. Um, also, uh, Slimming World, I put on a pound. Um, but the way I'm looking at that is that it's not a pound of fat that I've put on. It's just a pound of something like fluid or maybe I haven't been to the toilet enough and and stuff like that because I don't I my body feels different so my I, I feel slimmer if that makes any sense um I don't know I just feel like my body is maybe changing um and it's holding on to something to make that change I don't know I really don't know um hopefully this week I can be I was good that's the thing we was really good 
um, and I do think it sometimes you just fluctuate sometimes you just have more in your body than you should and I don't know all, all different stuff um, so it's just a case of getting back on it not worrying about it um, and I think the reason I'm thinking like this now is because I've got to my first target I'm a pound and a half over that now because I put on half a pound last week <laughs> and then put on a pound this week but I think I need to do some exercise. Um, so I'm going to get my hula hoop out this week. And I'm also going to do a couple of um, like YouTube workout things. I'm going to try and find someone that's that I can follow that's pretty like beginner friendly and stuff. And, and follow some YouTube um, workout things. Even if I do sort of two days of hula hooping and two days of the workout. I'll see how it goes. Um... I might gain muscle, obviously it weighs more than fat, so it might not work straight away, but I'm gonna, I, I want to incorporate a little bit more exercise, and hopefully with, if the weather uh, gets a bit nicer, I can go out for walks and stuff, I don't know, just be a little bit more active. Um, so that's the plan. I am going to go to bed very shortly because I am really tired. I'm going to get into bed and put the telly on and take this sock with me. So let me show you the sock. I have got the first one already um, done and I've got up to one, two, three, four, probably about 52, 53 rounds. I have got markers in but only up to 40. Um, so I am going to try and get this to the toe um, I'm going to sit in bed just for like half an hour put the telly on um, I might even watch a YouTube video or something um, we've got a fire stick in the bedroom so I can put that on we have got um, like all the apps on our telly in the bedroom like it is a smart TV but YouTube doesn't work <laughs> I don't know uh, it hasn't worked for a couple of years now for some reason it will come on but it won't let me do anything or it will just come up with YouTube and stay on that for ever it don't change um, so we did have a fire stick in here that we don't use anymore because the TV we've got is a smart TV and it's got everything on it but we use our skybox to use the apps um, so we've got like um, YouTube Netflix Disney Plus uh, Discovery, Apple TV, everything is on the Sky. Um, we are thinking of getting rid of the Sky in September, I think it's due for renewal. Um, and we are thinking of getting rid of it because the TV itself has got all the apps on it that we, we use. And plus, Ian's got an Xbox, so we could have apps on that as well. Um, but yeah, we're paying for it and we don't use it really. Like we you I watch YouTube majority of the time and then Ian finds something else to watch on one of these other subscriptions. Um and it was like it was tonight that Ian said, Oh, there's a new NCIS on. And I was like, Oh, okay then. I was like, Oh, what channel is it on? He was like, No, no, it's on Disney Plus. I was like, they're cottoning on to this, aren't they? That they're gonna put these exclusive episodes or start new series and put them on these paid platforms um so yeah it's uh it's a bit cheeky really i said to ian they're going to stop putting stuff on normal tv so then you have to pay if you want to watch it you have to pay for the um the the service of another app <laughs> um i also i looked at um, getting YouTube premium YouTube premium it's called where you don't have the ads or anything oh my goodness the price and I was like that is a lot that is that is a lot of money and I was looking at the family one because I thought well I could be on it Ian could be on it um, my dad could be on it and my uh, sister could be on it uh, I think you can have up to five extra or five altogether, um, but it's still a lot of money. Um, and I do appreciate everyone that does have 
YouTube Premium and watches my channel, obviously. Um, but I don't know. I just it's quite it's quite a lot. <laughs> um, just not to have adverts. I know you can get other perks as well, uh, like um, the music, and you can download stuff and um, watch it if you you're not got internet and, and and all that. But to be honest, I don't really do that sort of thing, and I don't use YouTube for music at all. Um, I'm sure there was other there was other perks as well, but I don't I don't really use it like that. So I don't know. I might, I might have a little think about it and see. Um, right, I have rambled on for nearly 18 minutes. <laughs> um, this was going to be a short vlog. It's now going to be a long one. Um, I'm probably going to end today here. And I will get this uploaded. And then tomorrow I will start just a fresh weekly vlog. And then I'll do that Monday to Sunday. And then... Um, get that uploaded on a Monday I think Monday or Tuesday I'm not 100% sure yet it's, it's, yeah we'll, we'll see um, within that I am going to try and get um, a podcast up at some point because I know people enjoy watching the podcast as well I don't know when that's going to be because obviously I've vlogged quite a lot and I've vlogged a lot of what I've made um, so I'm not 100% sure I am going to pull for the next socks out of my bag of wrapped yarn um, that will be tomorrow obviously I'm not going to be able to get this edited tomorrow because I'm going to be out um, I might be able to do it tomorrow evening or something depending on how tired I am um, yeah so I'm just thinking out loud now <laughs> Um, I just want to say thank you to everyone that's watched. Sorry this weekend vlog has not gone anywhere. Um, and it's not been very Eastery at all. Um, it was lovely seeing my Uncle David on Friday. Um, and Casey was busy yesterday. She was busy today. And she's busy tomorrow. So she, she's kept herself busy. Um, she did a... Um, a show at the weekend well, she did two different shows at the weekend uh, with her friend Chloe and she she's done pretty okay so that's really good um, it's nice that uh, she can she can do these shows and she can enjoy them and sell her stuff and and all that so yeah that's really good um, right I'm gonna stop waffling on and get into bed and put a little bit of telly on and probably fall asleep to it I'll put a timer on. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I shall see you all in the next video. Bye.